Now, a lot of people know how to make a basic cupcake, right? But have you ever tried an Anna Polyview cupcake? Maybe not. These cupcakes are sensational. They're like a magical cupcake. It's they? a magical <laughs> rainbow cupcake. So you've got the colourful cupcake, mm -hmm. then you've got the surprise in the centre, so when you bite into it, all these sprinkles come out. Wow. And then you've got your icing that's all different colours as well. So obviously over here we've got our flour, mm -hmm. our sugar, our unsalted butter, mm -hmm. our baking powder and a pinch of salt. So you're basically going to mix it all together and crumb it. Alright, I'll get onto that. And then over here what I've got is I've got my milk, my eggs, my vanilla paste and my vegetable oil as well. So I'm going to mix that all together. So is it the addition of the oil that makes these super moist, the crumb is just so delicate? Oh absolutely, but the key thing as well is add, you know, crumbing your butter into your flour mix, what actually happens is it doesn't overdevelop your gluten, so it still makes it quite soft and moist right. as well. So if I pulse this in the mixer, that's probably better to do that as opposed to giving it a really good mix. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. And a lot of times you can actually cream your ingredients, but in this case we're basically crumbing it. Okay, all right. So I'll just really quickly pulse this. Yeah. And the whole point of that is just mixing everything together before we start adding our butter. Okay. So the butter is at room temperature, so it's not too cold. All right, so I'll pulse this again until it becomes a fine crumb. Yep, and then I'm adding my vanilla paste and the oil straight after. All right, Anna, how is that looking? That looks perfect. It's all bind together, it's crummy, yep. and we're ready to go with our liquid mix. Nice. And I'm going to give you the wet ingredients sure. to add to it as well. In it goes. Pour that in there. And is it important not to over mix it at this stage too or it's okay to... It's basically until it binds all together. Mm -hmm. Okay, so on it goes and mix again. So now the fun part mm -hmm. is we're going to use all our different colours over here. So it's five different colours, five different bowls and we're going to mix all those beautiful colours through. And how good is the consistency of that batter? That's perfect. Yum. Oh, very good. Great. All right, what's next? So we're going to have the fun part. This is my favourite, favourite part. So it's basically playing with colour. So we've got five bowls. Mm -hmm. You need about 200 grams of the mix per bowl, so it's even. All right. But just be careful as well. You know, you can always add a little bit of colour, but you can never remove it. Uh -huh. So just watch how many drops you're actually putting in. So I usually put basically the lid mm -hmm. to just control a little bit. So I'm going to put two drops. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> too much? A little bit too much, but like I said, just have a little bit of control. Yes. But I want you to mix that up for me. Alright. Oh, look at that. I don't think that's too much. It looks pretty no, good. No, that's pretty okay. That's good. Happy with that? So the next step is basically just adding colour mm -hmm. to each mix. Okay. Then we put them into five individual piping bags mm -hmm. and then we pipe them into our cupcake cases. Alright. That's it. Let's just have some fun. So what you can see just in here is I've made sure that I'm piping my different colours in different pockets. <laughs> so the whole point of it is that when it bakes, yep. you can see the different colours pop. Yep. But when these cook, what happens? They sort of uh, mix in together and really make that marbled effect. Yeah, absolutely. So that's why it's important. See how I've got green there? Yep. I basically want to go green on the other side. Okay. And how full are you making them? Are you you don't want them all the way at the top because no. they will rise. Three quarters full. Three quarters full, okay. And how long are we baking them in the oven? So we basically bake it at 180 for about 20 to 25 minutes. Mm -hmm. All right, we're going to continue these. We're going to bake them, cool them, and then we'll show you the next step. Perfect. Justin, what I want you to do is get your icing sugar that you've already sifted yes. into your mixer. Now I'm doing this with a spoon because I do not want it to go everywhere. Yes. <laughs> and then after that you're going to add your unsalted butter that's been softened okay. at room temperature and you're going to blend it all together. Mm -hmm. Once it's all blended together, we add our milk and then we add our 
bubblegum flavour. Ooh. And then we're going to be doing uh, the same steps as we did for the cupcakes, separating all of this icing and then colouring them once again. Yep, so five different bowls, five different piping bags, and then the exciting part is I'm going to show you how to do the whole rainbow icing. All right, some more fun to make some icing. Yes. Mm -hmm. I just have to taste this after you adding the bubble gum. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Yummo! All right, let's separate them okay. into the bowls. <laughs> Anna, this is crazy. These cupcakes have come out of the oven. They are beautiful, rainbow colour. And now we're just organising all of the icings, uh, ready for the next stage. Yeah, absolutely. Exciting. <laughs> Okay, Anna, so we've got our rainbow colours ready to go. And yes. tell us what you're doing here. So basically when you pipe and you get that star nozzle and you go round, yep. all this will go into rainbow colour. Right. So we need to roll this up, mm -hmm. put into our piping bag mm -hmm. and go from there. So there is a little process here, but it's totally worth it because we're going to have these gorgeous rainbow Barbie-esque cupcakes. Only Anna would do something like this. Only Anna would do something as crazy as this. <laughs> and look at that. <laughs> wow, okay. So basically we've got our colours all lined up and yes. now we're going to force this through the piping bag and that's how they're going to melange or mix into that rainbow Absolutely, colour. and it doesn't have to be perfect. You yeah. know, baking and cooking in the kitchen is not about you know being perfect. It's about having fun and that's exactly what we've done today. We are having fun, all right. All right. So what I basically do is I'm keeping the clean film there mm -hmm. because it holds it all together. So we're just going to pull it back up. There we go. Really Leave good. it aside. And then the fun part. All so right. what we do is we need to cut the centre out. So just then basically this is an apple corer. Mm -hmm. So what you use for your apples, yep. but we're using for our cupcakes. Yeah, there's a little hole in there. Right, okay. So just then get your confetti. Mm -hmm. Sprinkles and then place it in the centre. I'll do this one. So this is that little magical surprise that we were talking about. And Justine, do this one as well. So sure. we've got two, one for you and one for me. Okay. Right in the centre. Oh, all right. And now, the magic. And then what I do is I start from the outside. Whoa, look at, oh! There we go. So that's your <laughs> rainbow and then we need a few more sprinkles on top of that. Whoa! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and a little bit more. Done. Anna, these are psychedelic cupcakes. That's what we'd call them, right? They are <laughs> magical cupcakes. And look at that, there's even little unicorns there. But if I cut into it... Mm -hmm. Please do. Oh. The sprinkles. That deserves a clap. That is the coolest cupcake I have ever seen. Shall we eat? Absolutely. So you're only having half. I'm like, I'm not sharing. <gasps> oh. Mm -hmm. Anna, thank you so much. Absolutely love it. You know what? My little nieces, for their second birthday, this is what I'm going to be making them. It's not even for kids, it's for adults as well. Mm. Look at the colourful hands, the colourful mouth, and the colourful day we're going to have today. This is awesome. <laughs> <laughs>